Man, I don't even think Curry that good. I just think he real lucky. You crazy. <laughs> he can't be that lucky. They think he's just lucky, man. The boy can shoot that thing. It's like, I don't know. I'm going to call you back. You hey. play ski ball? What's up, y'all? What up, What's what up, man? What up, what up, Ice? What's up, man? What's How up? you doing? I bring you the president of Hoops. Oh, the president of Hoops. Good to meet you. Right, I'm honored. I'm going to need you to hook him up, give him that presidential cut. The presidential cut? Come on, you know, hook him up. Presidential cut. We do regular haircuts here, so I hope you like just regular haircuts. Man, don't let him lie to you. Hook him up one of them special Why ice people cuts. Hook him up? Why you keep on saying hook him up? Like, I'm gonna hook him up more. This is a barbershop. I'm gonna hook him up more than this. Yeah, man, just just keep it simple, guys. Yeah, I'm just trying to get it cleaned up. Nothing crazy. All right, thought I could work with. Yeah, hook him up. So I see you brought your boy. Yeah. You bring us some tickets? Oh, I got tickets for you guys. Just not today. Of course, not today. Uh, Not today. It wasn't yesterday either. When we get back from the road trip, we got you. And y'all wanted to hook up. Well, I hook up. I'm Zach, not, I'm bringing the future MVP to the league. Reciprocation, man. That's one haircut. We just, can I got some sneakers for you, okay, Ice, if you, you want some sneakers. See? I take some sneakers. I don't want your sneakers. <laughs> okay. All right. You want to give me a cut? I got some shorts. I got you. Yeah, you just give me a little lineup, man. Don't do nothing too, you, too special. Man. Happy you came back. Hey, man, you be doing... This here mine, this here mine. That's it right there, that this here mine. This here. What, what are you doing? I'm working my signature dance. Everybody got signature dance when they get hot. Okay. Y'all work that out. Young. I got, Young. I got practice. Baby, come on, sit. Yo, Denver, Mm-mm. just let it flow, man. Like, whatever happens spontaneously on the court, let that be it. Man, I'm going to be ready for mine. Watch, friends. When coach calls me out there, I'm going to have my shot down. I'm going to have my dance down. All right, let's see it. Everybody goes, let's see it. Because this right here, this is me pointing like this, here, mine. Ready? This, here, mine. This, here, mine. Everybody can do it. This, here, mine. Where the rap is at? This, here, mine. I'm going to call Drake. Someone get Drake on the phone. This, here, mine. Hey, that's right there. That's the one. That's the one you shoot it. Look out of place on it. All right, guys. We're back with some more of my career today. We are playing the Minnesota Timberwolves. And they're going to put me on small forward most of the game. And I tell you what, I am tired of this. I I had a feeling that playing small forward was going to be tough. Well, playing in Denver is going to be tough because they have so many guards. And, you know, Denver is my favorite team, but, damn, it's, I'd never get to play shooting guard at all. So, I mean, I don't even know if this is uh, small forward is my position or what. But look at that pass to Gallo with an assist. Uh, I mean, I, like I said, I, ri- I really would like to play shooting guard. They actually got me on shooting guard. I don't know what I was talking about, but it, I mean, uh, for the rest of the game, I play small forward. Oh, look at that. That's an assist to Justice Young, and you know what that sets up. We got the uh, orange juice thing coming, I hope. I haven't hit it yet. I want to hit it, but uh, I don't, I mean, I think it's like five times. Five straight passes to back in the back and forth of each other, and then Orange Juice comes on, and so it's been pretty tough. But Zach Levine fouls me. It didn't look like a foul at all. I mean, I was fine with taking these shots, obviously, because I'm gonna get them every time. And there we go with the first one, and here we go with the second one. So this was a pretty close game uh, through the first quarter. Let me say that right now. But look at that steal. The defense there was insane. Now I'm at small forward. I told you guys I was at small forward a lot of the game. But look at Justice Young. Does not want it again. He, like when I pass it to this dude most of the time, he does not shoot the ball. But when somebody else passes it to him, he shoots the ball. It's kind of annoying to be honest. Uh, so. Oh, that's green light. Freaking three pointer. Let's go. Make it five points in the first quarter. It was a slow first half. Uh, I was having trouble with my three-point shot. I mean, it was I was doing terrible. Uh, so look at there, Justice Young actually gonna no, he's not. Yes, okay, no, he didn't. But we do, and that's gonna go in and set up the orange juice thing one more time. But it starts over every quarter. That's kind of dumb. But you know, whatever. We gotta be better to get five assists every quarter. Look at that freaking block. Sets up the three-point play. No, it don't. I told you guys I was having trouble with my three points all game, especially in the first half. It was terrible. I hit nothing. I mean, oh my gosh. And that was the worst screen I've ever seen. And then we turn it over, Zach Lafine, and we take it from him. 
Let's go. Playing defense out here. You'll see that I've had a... I'm going to have a good all-around game. There's another assist. If I can't score, I'm going to try to dish the ball out every time and get an assist. I'm that unselfish player, you know what I'm saying? So here we go. With about seven seconds left. Here we go. I should have took that three, but we passed the guy nine for the assist. Uh, I think I would have made that one. I was wide open, but now here we go in the third quarter. We are destroying them. It's our first blowout game. Look at that. Justice Young actually makes the shot. And that's three, but it, each time it's been in a different quarter, so we have not been able to actually get it. And there we go with two this quarter as we get that one. Actually, I mean, I don't know why it wasn't, but whatever. Uh, we still got 10.5 assists, two rebounds, two steals, and one block. Make that three steals. We are playing the defensive game of our lives out here. And, uh, well, okay, then we kind of just both turned it over like three times in that whole little thing. That was a little bit weird, but... Andrew Wiggins guarding me again, like I said, I play small forward mostly every game, but that's a three, wide open, you don't leave me with space because I'm going to knock it down 50% of the time, I can't say 100% of the time because that's not how it works, try to set the screen up for Justice Young, I mean, I don't know, I, if people, some people can get this dude to score, I cannot, oh, that's another three, he hit me through the contact, I still made the bucket, and now this is my the last of my playing time as they are going to sub me out with the last couple seconds to go in the third i don't play the fourth quarter at all because we're just blowing them out i've got 16 points five assists four rebounds for it four steals and blocks it, it's insane we had the greatest game ever not necessarily scoring wise but stat sheet wise and i think that's great I think that's, uh, one of the best things you can do in a game There he is. Yo, Rez. Ernie and the guys in the studio want to talk to you. All right, let's get it. The 2K Sports Post Game Show. Welcome back, everybody. Ernie Johnson, along with Shaquille O'Neal, Kenny the Jet Smith, as we present our Jordan Player of the Game, Rez. Hey, what's up? It's Kenny here, man. You guys won this one going away. Now, what was it that gave your team such an advantage tonight? Uh, man, I thought we worked really, you know, really well together. Everyone did what they were supposed to do on both ends of the floor, and, and we took the game plan that Coach gave us and, and ran it exactly the way he asked, basically. Yeah, it was pure perfection tonight. You guys were effortless, and uh, great job again. Thank you so much, man. Have a good one. That's going to do it for our, our broadcast tonight. We certainly hope you've enjoyed the show, don't we, guys? It was great. Yeah. Kenny Smith, Shaquille O'Neal, and for Kevin Harlan and the entire 2K Sports crew, all 653,000 of them. Yeah, it's a lot. Hardworking. A lot of people. Yeah. It's a long line at the buffet, though. Yeah. Shout out to the T poles, man. Yes. Oh, I don't know sure. his name, but I know his face. I'm Ernie Johnson. See you next time. All right, Prez. I've done all the legwork. And as a lottery pick, you're going to have plenty of options. See, these companies, they believe in what you're going to be in the league. And they see your potential. So they want you to represent their brand. Now, let's take a look at the options. Nike wants you bad. See, their plan is to bring you on the team right away with a straight merch deal and put you in a pair of team Nike shoes. Then you'll be one of the faces of the brand leading to your own signature shoe, billboards, commercials, the whole nine. Can't go wrong with the swoosh, baby. <laughs> and right next door is brand Jordan, team MJ. Sounds pretty good, right? They want to start you out with a cash deal and put you in in a team-themed shoe. And if you continue to rise, if your star gets higher, they want to graduate you from a custom colorway all the way to your customized signature shoe and all the perks that go with it. But what they really want is for you to be the face of the brand. You and the power and prestige of Jordan, the GOAT himself riding side by side off into the sunset. I mean, come on. Jordan, are you kidding me? They look awesome. Guess what it is now.
Now, this is when it starts to get really interesting. Under Armour is banking on you being part of their team. They want to make you the face of their brand sooner than later. They're talking cash deal, lots of opportunity for bonuses, and a UA team shoe. I mean, this is a real opportunity to get in line with a fast, young, hustling company. Right? What do you think? And last, but certainly not least, Adidas. And they want to run with the presidential theme. I mean, they're talking billboards, cash deal, and they want to make you a custom colorway, Adidas shoe featuring the colors of the American flag. And get this, they want a custom billboard with the presidential theme. And we're talking commercials, ads, signature shoes. I mean, I think Adidas is the place to go if we want to run with the presidential theme. I'm in. Are you? So it's up to you. I mean, I know it's a lot to think about, but you're in a pretty good position right here. Look, I don't know, Bruce. I feel like this is harder than picking a college, you know? Like, way harder. I, I need a, a spreadsheet to remember all that stuff. Yeah, yeah, it's a lot. It's a lot. But, you know, personally, you can't lose, right? You're in a win-win situation. So it's wherever you feel the most comfortable. And not just on your feet, but as a business partner. So take your time, kick back, relax, think about it, and I just need an answer in about five minutes. Oh my gosh, guys, what do we pick? What do we pick? Nike, Adidas, Under Armour, or Jordan? This was tough. I liked all the things they pitched to me, but you know what? I'm going to have to go with... Nice. Good choice. This is the beginning of big things. Adidas is going to be so pumped about that choice. I hope so, man. I'm telling you, I'm excited to get it started. <laughs> Gotta love it. My Adidas and me. It's like I used to break dance in those things when I was a kid. All right, guys. Yes, we picked Adidas. They want to go with the whole American tribute, and I really like that because, of course, I'm the president. So here's some text messages. Uh, that we got like subscribe and comment. I am out. Thank you so much for watching